so hello guys uh, in the last video we end up here on a crane girder definition so let's do it remember that I will follow all the steps shown here let's switch to robot let's go to start let me close this select this over here and press the new section definition icon over here press this and now we have got to do a parametric section okay so let's go to parametric let's select this icon it's the same on the manual and I'm going to choose 40 over here 55 over here 25 over here 1.5 over here 1.5 over here and last but not least 1.5 I'm going to add close close now let me select the bar let me select the bar type which will be a beam and select this section already selected and the coordinates will be 6 0 10 6 36 10 press enter okay there we go as you may see now let's make a translation I'm going to select this and go to edit edit move or copy remember that you can press also alt e e m I think it's faster okay now let's make the translation vector which will be this one minus 12 0 0 and press enter okay now let's define some additional loads let's go to loads let me go to the fifth row here and select the third load case from the list which will be win 2 it will be a uniform load apply in all the corner columns okay we change this to the top view select this column keep the control pressed this column this column and this column over here let me check if I have done this right okay and now let me apply a just uniform load of value 2 I'm just going to press enter there we go and I'm going to click in the view and as you may see we have already defined that load case now let's define the moving load applied to the crane girder that we have previously defined let's go to let's go to tools menu job preferences and define here the database I've already done that let's go to vehicle database I'm going to do it again as you may see I don't have e here a user database so I'm going to press this button and the database will have this name user create there you go let's move now let's go to loads menu special moving loads menu special loads moving now let I'm going to select the new vehicle icon over here I'm going let me choose user of course I'm going to choose the new button over here I'm going to give it a name which will be moving crane okay now the load type will be a concentrated force here will be 20 here 0 and here it will be 12 on the second line of the table now and I'm also def I'm going to define load just like that 
concentrated load 20 here over here 1.5 and here 12 okay now I'm going to left mouse click and save to the database which will be the user database I'm going to press actually this add yes I'm going to press close now and uh, I am actually running out of time we end up in this point here over here now we are going to define on the next video the rest of this load case thank you for watching